Hi there guys, here's your Dawn Marathon and today I would like to take out the carbon fiber plate of my Vaporfly 4% but first of all I would like to say these shoes right here marketing lie by Nike it's a marketing lie by Nike that these shoes are supposed to only be good for 160 kilometers mine were good for 1000 kilometers and I'm sad to have to rip them apart but I tell you, they are very good, they are still bouncy, and that ZoomX material is not wearing off, as they say, maybe on the outer parts, but not the cushioning itself. So, do what you want, but I will keep the other vapor flies, which I have forever. Peace out. Up, here's your dawn back again, and today is the day. It's judgment day for these shoes. It's a happy but also sad day because I decided to cut these niggas apart, these sneakers, and well, it's the 1000th kilometer and the Vapor 5 4%, which I had sponsored, and I decided to take out the nylon carbon, no, the carbon fiber plate, it's not the Zoom Fly, the carbon fiber plate, and to put it into the Nike Vapor Street, to make a Nike Vapor Street elite out of them. Well, first of all, I gotta try to take them out and clean them, and then I will put them into the vapor flies into the vapor street, and hopefully it's gonna work that I can use them as a training shoe, which is faster than all the others except the vapor fly four percent. So stay tuned and check out how I smash and rip them apart. Peace out, your crazy dog. So here's part one, here you can see the sole and the wonderful Zoom X material and right here you have the carbon fiber plate, look at it, I better, better listen to it, wait a second, there it is, see, now I'm gonna try to under, have it undergo surgery and take it out. So my friends, here is the Zoom Vaporfly carbon fiber plate. As you can see, I've managed to take it out. It was a piece of work. This is the upper. This is the sole. It's intact. Wonderful foam. Here it is. The most famous carbon fiber plate in the world of the Vaporfly 4%. This is all the hype. This is what it's all about. This tiny carbon fiber plate. Of course, I still need to clean out the, the final residues part of the rubber here, the ZoomX material, and to weigh it. And I'll be back tomorrow. Of course, I'll put this in one video, but tomorrow I'll weigh this cut this one apart as well and then I'll do a follow-up video with the Vapor Street which is gonna have this carbon fiber plate I'm so excited especially as to whether this shoe is gonna really have a positive impact uh, with regard to velocity I think it, it is possible the shape of this plate is going all the way down okay it's not made for the Vapor Street but I still believe I can manage to have an advantage with this one if it won't break my foot. But I think I can manage it. Well, we'll see. I'm just trying it. So stay tuned, guys.